behind the scenes look at all that takes place in order to stage a live, you know, in order to stage a dance production. It's the making of a dance concert, but they're going to be little skits or stories that are love related, interspersed, I don't know if that's the right word, you know, throughout, throughout the, um, the project. And uh, I'm from Guadeloupe. It's, in, it's a little island in the French West Indies. And I've been in the US since 2004, so it's four years now. And, and uh, going to school, and now I'm, I'm dancing with a company, uh, Urban Bush Women, which is the great way I met Maya. And now we work together, and I love it. Students of the Geneva Center are the very young, the very old, black, white, beige, and brown. It represents a diverse fiber that is one of the best things about this city. But now squeezed out, one cannot help but wonder if Manhattan is pricing out its culture. So the school is closing, Geneva School of Dance and Drama is closing today. Like today is the last class, and I bet like all of the students are going to turn out and it's going to be like 50 people in that studio like as this to celebrate like the last class at this center the center that's been open for 15 years closing down today so it's going to be off the hook all the drummers going to be there there's going to be like a, a band of percussionists it's going to be awesome wish i could tape it <laughs> This is what you want to see in a dance center. The beat of life and music, diverse cultures side by side. This is what you do not want to see at a dance center. After 15 years in its Gramercy digs, the Geneva Dance and Drum Center is out of business 
set packing.